Canadian Blood Services has issued an apology to Canada's LGBTQ2S plus communities today, acknowledging the harms done to gay, bisexual, queer and trans people by its former donor policy. CTV's Rachel Aiello has more on this and joins us now. Rachel, tell us a little bit more about the apology and why it was needed. Good morning. Yeah, so back in 2022, Canadian Blood Services updated its donation policy when it comes to blood and plasma. Before that, there had been an initial lifetime ban, eventually over the years moved to what was a three-month deferral period for men who have sex with men. So this essentially prevented sexually active gay and bisexual men, some trans uh, community members, from donating blood and plasma. Uh, this apology comes, now they are saying, in an effort to rebuild trust with the LGBTQ2S plus community in Canada, noting that it was a long time coming and directly saying sorry today for the discrimination and the harm that the perpetuating of stereotypes this long-standing ban had on Canadian uh, LGBTQ2S plus community members. And what is the reaction we're getting for this? So today we heard first initially from the CEO of Canadian Blood Services, but then he opened up this conversation to hear from advocates and community groups, and they each took their turn acknowledging the historic nature of this apology, appreciative that it has finally come years after the policy updated. Now Canadian Blood Services uh, screens out donors based on their sexual behavior and based not on gender or sexual uh, orientation. However, there was some uh, acknowledgement of the fact that there are still ways that there is indirect discrimination through this policy to which Canadian Blood Services says they are willing to continue to work with members of the queer community to talk about ways that it could be further improved. Related to this though, this week it is worth noting, Health Canada did update the policy for sperm and ova donation and indicated that there could potentially be changes coming when you're looking at tissue and organ donation. Okay, CTV's Rachel Allo, thank you for that update. Thanks.